quit blowing then. <laughs> Gotta say, I do love your perfume. <laughs> She's a copper. Train on young women, are we? Well, today's not your lucky day, mate. Oh, it's a long guy. Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm just going to get a bacon butty, okay? Okay, bye. It's been a year, Jessica. I know what Katie meant to you, to all of us. But there are other important cases that need your input. Foster, that bastard is still out there. This could cost you your job. So, some low-life smugglers deserve priority over Katie's rape and murder. Is that what you're saying? Maybe it's time to take a step back. No. I swear to you. One of these little rats has a tattoo on him. You can't strip down every guy in Manchester to check his forearm. Strip him? I'm going to rip the guy into pieces for what I did to Katie. Excuse me, what the fuck do you think you're doing? Put that down. This is Sergeant Mark Langford. He's your new partner. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm here to make sure you stick to procedure. So basically you're babysitting me. Jessica, watch your mouth. Mr. Langford reports to the... Reports the Queen, for all I care. Come on then, Mark. Hurry up. Oh, and bring some baby wipes with you. They were right about Mrs. Creswell. She's a bloodthirsty demon queen. Try to catch her at the gym. That's where she usually goes to blow off steam. There you are. 
So you've done kissing Foster's ass, have you? Brilliant. Talk to me when you're free. Yeah, well, give me a sec. I'm just going to finish beating Billy's ass up first. Oh, we'll see about that. <laughs> yeah, it won't be long, I promise. Creswell, stop! You've already won! We should start bonding. Come on. Share a few awkward stories. I have to report on your progress, but I can't. Shh. Just no more office blah blah, all right. Just let me do my job. I've come in here quite a lot recently. See that guy over there? That's the prime suspect, Eddie Davis. I can't let you. Mark, you don't understand. I need to resolve this. I saved Katie that night. I know she meant the world to you. But there's a lawful way of arresting the killer. Yeah, but I could have called her a taxi. I could have walked her home, but I didn't. So it's my fault. I should have protected her. No matter how many guys you beat up, you won't bring her back. It's just... I mean, your world's been... God, crushed. The only thing I can do to fix this is just to get this guy. I'm just gonna have to lie on this report, aren't I? I need some playtime. Be a good babysitter, will you? I'm gonna go and make some new friends. Oh, hey guys. What are you up to tonight? Hiya. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You right? <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. No fucking way. It's the wrong tattoo again. What are you again. doing? Oh, hey, well, oh, leave it, Jess. Sort her out. I know you were there. If you know something, we'll bring him in. By the book. Yeah, what kind of babysitter are you anyway? Worst one ever. Letting your little girl play with the big bad boys. <laughs> Ryan, Andrew Stockton. Yeah. Ryan. Where were you on October the 9th last year? What? Oh, you're talking about Katie Bard? Ryan, what the fuck? I'm D.I. Jessica Creswell. I'm afraid I'm going to have to take Brian in for the interrogation. I never meant to hurt anyone. Please, put the gun down. I'm not that kind of guy, I swear. Brian Andrew Stockton. Third year student at the MMU. No criminal record. This is like watching a wolf devour a sheep. Brian Andrew Stockton. You're accused of the rape and murder of Katie Barnes. It's as plain as day that it was you on the CCTV footage. I'm telling the truth. I, Eddie, he gave me cocaine before the night out. I don't remember anything. Don't give me that shit, you little bastard. 
I'm worried about a state of mind. Shall we step in? No. Let's see if Mrs. Cresswell has learned anything. <sighs> Kate was a psychiatrist who was working here. And she's someone who was very, very dear to me. I've not been through hell this past year, you know, for nothing, tracking you down. You're not walking away from this. She's gonna lose it. Brian, I need you to confess. The longer you leave it, the more it's gonna hurt. What? Don't be stupid! Look, if you admit to substance abuse prior to Katie's murder, then the sentence could be lowered. You could hire a good lawyer, you know. An absence of a criminal record would count in your favour. Oh, wow. The thirsty demon queen no more. You make an excellent babysitter. Naughtiest child I've ever dealt with. Shit, I'll just get your sausage roll instead. Alright. 